Winner guaranteed fourth place for the loser, and winner gets the chance to go on and challenge the loser of winner's finals, which will be DeBuzz and DePumpster. That hasn't happened yet, but that'll be next. So here it is, loser semifinals. Two of the top threats in the region, two of the top characters in the game. Diddy Kong versus Sonic, 6WX playing Sonic, of course, uh, as he has loyally since Brawl. j -Tales switching from a Meta boss? Knight Diddy Kong hybrid main in Brawl to solo Diddy Kong in this game. Definitely a choice I can respect. Uh, but not one that a lot of people are very fond of. They hate fighting JTL's Diddy. He's like the innovator in this region of yeah. this character. He's a very wild Diddy, too. If you he notice, is, man. he has a lot of techniques I don't see any other Diddy use. And that's one of the reasons I think he got top 16 at Apex. He won the last two he K-Tars. did also get top yeah. 16 at Apex. Forgot about that. And last time he won the last K-Tar where there was 160 people, he brought it back from losers to win the whole tournament. So Yeah, you're yeah. right. He did. So maybe he could do it again. And JTL's one of the only players with uh, wins on DeBuzz in this region. 6WX, the other, um, who actually reset the bracket against DeBuzz last weekend at Smash Attack. Oh, yeah. So, let's see. These guys, they're in loser brackets. Only one of them is going to get a chance to go to Grands, if that. Goodness, he has the hammer yep, on one now. Yep, now he switched back, yep. That's interesting. I didn't know he had uh, different, certain picks for certain characters. I think he likes the fire one against Sheik because it does a lot of damage, and uh, getting that damage on Sheik is really important because yeah. you always want to kill her as early as possible. Yeah, and you want to move really fast versus Sheik. You don't want to stay in her range to get grabbed. Right. Oh and my goodness. Also, uh, it keeps him low to the ground, whereas this one gets him off the ground, which is really useful versus Diddy Kong. Look at him, look at him moving. Sonic speed. Oh, oh just calls his bluff there. Knew that 6WX is going for an empty landing. Good choice. It just goes over to Banana. So if you know Diddy Kong's going to throw it, do the hammer thing. Maybe flop him in the ground. Charge up smash. It's like a dive kick. And the dive kick landing cancels directly into rolling forward more with Spin Dash and being wow. extremely safe. Wow. Oh wow. my god, J-Tails. If he had done it correctly and done his up air when he was supposed to, a little bit later he would have gotten it to work. Yep, all he had to do was just wait out the first air dodge. But instead, got a little greedy, and swinging early. It looked like he ran in the spin dash. That should be cool. That's it, yeah. Wow. Sonic's back throw, man. Good stuff right there. And I like that placement of the spring there by 6WX. It's like, <laughs> hey, man, when you're coming down off this respawn platform, you're about to land on this and lose all your invincibility. Oh, my goodness. 6WX with the sexy movement. Ooh. Looking like he's in the club. Wow. Oh, my God. That almost killed at 74. <laughs> Oh! Yeah, he just, he's like, oh, I don't care about oh, barrels. I got so many jetpacks, bro. Here, go hang out with your jetpack outside. NASA Diddy Kong in the building. <laughs> okay, just fades in, uh, I'm sorry, fades out with that jump. 6WX, very smart with the baits here, but uh, JTL's not quite biting. Oh, oh my no. god, is that an SD? He nah. Wow. Oh, but nice punish right there. Virtually an SD. Yeah. Because <laughs> if he had stayed on the stage like he probably planned, he probably would not have gotten hit by an F-Smash. Oh, j -Tail's looking hard for this grab. He knows he can take about 30% just from one. I just feel like he should take out the banana. The banana will help stop Sonic from running around all over the place. Going in for a grab against Sonic. You would think Sonic, that. But <laughs> yeah, that's true. But going in for a grab against Sonic with nothing in your hand yeah, is like very trying to risky. catch a fly. And it's the best fly in the world. Ranked yeah. number one. Definitely a top tier fly <laughs> right now. Ooh. Okay. Dash attack. I'm sorry. Down tilt. Keeping him safe from the grab, which would have been yeah. his death. And when he almost gets the grab, he jab attacks out of it. There's no grab armor like there was in Brawl. Right. Oh, brilliant pressure there from J-Tails. Just down tilt into the quick little short hop up air. And oh, no. no. He did that peanut, and there's a lot of lag after the peanut. So I think he, he had no second jump. I think he also went for the uh, the charge time, you know, but released so he didn't get up B spring spiked. Yeah. That would have been the end of him. But J-Tails was like, all right, man, I'm just going to respect it, try to reach but nah if he held it charging for a little bit longer he actually would have been able to grab the edge but he paid 6wx too much respect because yeah. he didn't even go for the upbeat exactly all right i think 6wx is probably going to stay with the same custom set that really seemed to work out well for him but if he switches to fireman then, you know the it could fire work out man? Hey. that's a good gunblade shout out to the kid shout out to the kid gunblade uh looking awesome and most amazing. valuable gaming most yeah. valuable gunblade must really yeah that, that's actually kind of cool so uh, shout out to MBG. I see all the stuff they're doing for Smash. They're doing quite well with it. Having um, M2K and Zero pretty much staying in their area, if not at their place. Yeah, I and think they all live together now in like yeah. a big think tank of Smash. Yeah, streaming every single night. Um, shout out to Gregory. He's an awesome guy too. He's always on the stream. Yeah, definitely shout out to MBG doing some big things, having an actual concentrated league for nice Smash. That's something we need, like this nationwide uh, 
coalition of tournaments. Yes. And we have, this is a uh, loser's semifinals, just in case anyone's wondering. Yes. And for it's currently only 9.30, not that bad. This tournament will probably over by 10.30. And we uh, that would be nice. Everything, streaming all of top 10, actually. Wow. Yeah, I mean, uh, there's only this match, winner's finals, loser's finals, grand finals left. So. Wow, pretty good. Only a couple more sets. Down to the wire, as they say. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Delfino Plaza, though, the jank of all jank. I'm very surprised to see JTEL's counterpick the stage against Sonic. There's walk-offs. There's still oh. an off-stage portion that could really be bad for Diddy Kong. I can tell you exactly why this is a good stage for Diddy Kong. Because the, the stage, ceiling is yeah, super stage low. Yeah, stage transform, ceiling, whatever. It, it's all good for uh, Diddy Kong. You just wing it out and up air. Might kill him at 40%. Gotcha. Ooh, I guess JTL's just confident enough in the portions of the stage that are ridiculous for Diddy Kong that he doesn't care about the ones that are ridiculous for Sonic. Oh my gosh, Jad knew he was going to walk off the stage, turn around, grab. Missed the grab, but so close. Oh my, okay, gets the command oh, grab, but the oh stage no. transformation ruining his day. <laughs> yeah, and then he immediately got ground pounded too. Oh man, 6WX, so tricky. He yeah. just is never in the same spot, and... He's just playing to the strengths of his character. How can you play Sonic and not always be on the move? He's the fastest thing alive. Alive. Uh, one of the funny things... Oh, Palutena. Oh, he was about to be the fastest thing <laughs> dead if jtel has <laughs> got that up there up there. there. Uh, one thing I noticed about 6WX, he's barely getting grabbed. So it's not making the... You don't see the hoo-ha. Wait, I spoke to you. Oh, who? So. Oh. Uh, who no? <laughs> who who nah? <laughs> who nah? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Can he get the banana? Oh my yeah. god, <laughs> these cross-ups are so real. 6WX showing why he placed fourth at Apex. The man is a killer. He almost went over there and he's like, nah. <laughs> 6WX he has gone through Nairo, False, who else? He lost to the Puffster earlier. Yeah, though. the Puffster has been taking out 6WX pretty cleanly recently. Oh, okay. up throw? No. Yeah, no, not on Sonic. Too not that percent. percent. Yeah. Wow. wow! He should have went for that. I, saw, I guess he thought he was going to land on the stage after he threw the banana. Man, Back the throw, that ultra jank. Good. Maybe banking on the ceiling shrinking. Oh my. Kind of a smart idea. Taking out that banana just saved him from getting that up air. Oh, imagine that grabbed him. That would have been so clean. j -tails, though, speaking of clean, needs to uh, shower off those up airs right there because yeah. he was not completing. And that was a weird uh, punish. One thing I noticed about the stage, too, it allows Diddy Kong to take out his banana and begin his setup, whatever he wants. Yeah, depending on the transformation, you can have a lot of space away from your opponent. My gosh. Oh, and ow. that's why he didn't do it before. And oh. there we go. Never recover low as Diddy Kong in general. Like, he didn't have much of a choice there, but if you can recover high, certainly do it. If you want to main Diddy Kong, just keep that in mind. Never be forced into charging your up B when they can get something out like that spring. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what you got, J Tails. This is definitely looking in his favor. If he gets this grab down. Oh. I love how J Tails uses cross up rolls like very creatively in his gameplay. Smart DI by 6WX. Yeah. But not Good enough. stuff to him. He's always DIing it correctly. What up B? That's and that'll be it. Yeah. All right. One apiece in loser semis. Last best of three of the day. Diddy Kong wins without much hoo-ha. Oh, that thing? Yeah, it's I like love it. He just grabs his face like... <laughs> I'm sorry, I got my butt in the face. It smells like strawberries. So uh, it smells like strawberries. Um, I'll have to... 6 wx is Sonic? Yeah, it's, it's pretty nice. <laughs> okay, uh, so what's the counterpick going to be? I'm curious as to what J-Tail's banned, because I feel like Diddy and Sonic both kind of thrive on the same stages. Halberd, you know, mm -hmm. ceiling KOs. But okay. I'm sure 6WX isn't going to let that stage happen. I feel like he's going to... Okay, so... Uh, it was... Who won the last match, actually? j tells j tells So, um, I think 6WX is try going to try to go to FD, but most likely j tells saw him go there last time. He's going to ban it. Yeah, so. I think they're going to Town and City, it seems. Okay, not a bad choice. Yeah. Fairly neutral stage, but, you know, it's got those janky Frigate Orpheon kind of, like, yeah. whisk you away platforms. <laughs> so that's why it's not a neutral. Actually, is it a neutral today? Uh, yes, it yeah, is. Uh, five Evo, yeah. yeah, Evo made it a neutral. Yeah, interesting choice, but hey, man, whatever. Okay, 6WX just playing the corner game. He's like, all right, I'm going to come down from those platforms when I feel like it. And then you're going to get hit by my spin, uh, spin dash. This is exactly how this match is going to go. Yeah, this is a pretty big stage, too. So, j is having a lot of trouble getting anything while 6WX is doing all the moves he wants. Can you almost just kill himself here? <laughs> no, I don't think it was that close. Ooh, breaking the peanuts with spin dash. That's really sad for Diddy Kong. Wow. But the peanut can't stop him. <laughs> oh my god, and neither can the banana. He At least on the way up. Yeah, he just walked away and decided to shield the entire uh, hammer spin dash. 
game. Very close game, though. These two going blow for blow here. A minute pass, just about. You saw him jump over Sonic like that? He's like, oh, he's going to run past me. It's like they're circus act right now. A hedgehog and a monkey <laughs> shooting guns and rolling up into blur balls of blueness. And if you want some peanuts, he can just shoot one at you in the crowd. Oh, my. How's 6WX going to convert this juggle situation? Nice, a little pivot slide, just the turnaround out of dash into jab. Very creative stuff. You don't see a lot of players really using that too much. Actually, Raptor does, um, but 6WX definitely... Ooh, very tricky by going, assuming a pivot grab. No, oh, the banana, just for good measure. Take yeah. that extra 1%. <laughs> That was so crafty by JTL. Sets the banana up in front of him and yeah. just can throw a big high risk move like forward smash. Like, yeah, come, come punish us, bro. Ha, oh <laughs> JK. Good. Back throw, that's it. No way. Yeah, even at 81%, the Buzz and the Puffs are holding their mouths as they wait <laughs> and win his finals. <laughs> JTL goes for the up throw even at 100 plus. That's almost guaranteed to not combo. Maybe a little bit of loss of composure here, but I don't know. That up air out of shield is looking pretty clean. Oh. So, JTL's still in it. That's yes. It, yes. He needs to be able to DI that a little bit better. 6WX normally DIs it well, but that time, like at high percent, some people just don't do it, and then that's it. Yeah, and sometimes you're just, you know, it's very counterintuitive to hold <gasps> it. No! Oh, 6WX could have gone for two more two jabs. Two more jabs, yeah, if he did jab, jab, let him die. I feel like it would have worked. Wow, that was almost like the craziest end to a set ever. Yeah. And that, folks, is why this stage shouldn't be neutral. <laughs> I'm down for it. Evo's down for it. Okay, very smart empty hop, just baits him to release the spin dash. JTL is able to block in time. Trying to reset that stage control. Wow, JTL's being tricky by dropping a banana on 6WX's head. Ooh. Oh, 6WX with a really ambiguous landing. He's like, oh, I'm just going to fall straight and do nothing. Nah, psych, last minute Nair. <laughs> spin dash to Nair, too, just oh. keeping it going for him. Got too risky going for the banana. Should have just. Oh, this is the back throw. These guys just going for their characters' respective 1 2. Spin dash to aerials, down throw to stuff. Can JTLs keep his Katar crown that he's won the last two times for Smash for 3DS and Wii U? Oh man, he's 5% closer to doing so. Okay, but this is definitely not going to time, of course, but what is important is who has to approach. And no, dropping the lead <gasps> so quickly. Down throw is going to keep him off. Is he going to... Oh, oh my Oh my goodness. god. One frame late oh, by 6WX. Oh, no and DI! No DI! No DI. That's a heartbreaker. To think that 6WX is literally one frame on his forward smash release away from taking that set 2-1 and then just got the swift hoo-ha wow. by JTLs. That was a quick turnaround. I feel like 6WX should have won it if he got the F smash and then he had no DI again at high percent. Yep. That caused him that to rage up air, man. Who to the ha? Yes.